Hallo zusammen, I'm your Vlog Dave. Since this channel is about learning German, some of you ask me every now and then basically, well, can you recommend any other German YouTubers that are worth watching? And well, I personally think Gronk is one of them. So let's talk about him and find out more about what he does on YouTube. As you might have guessed, Gronk is just a nickname. His real name is Erik Range and he was born in Braunschweig, which is in northern Germany. Gronk is widely considered to be one of the most successful and popular German YouTubers, in terms of subscribers and views and all that stuff. But although he's pretty well known and quite popular in the German YouTube scene, he is really down to earth I'd say. And that is really something that I like a lot. In recent months and years he also has had many public appearances, for instance as a talk show guest on German TV or at the annual German gaming convention, the Gamescom. To many German YouTube viewers and especially to those with an affinity to gaming, Gronk is mostly known for being a so-called let's player. Ich kenne da eine wunderbar entspannende orientalische Nackenmassage. Ja. So. And every now and then Gronk also uploads rather special videos, for instance his G-Logs, his Gronk vlogs so to speak. And on top of all that, he has also become a live streamer on Twitch. Gronk became increasingly popular, especially by playing the, back then, still kinda underground indie game Minecraft. This led to over a thousand episodes of that single let's play. So I already mentioned a couple of aspects. but. What exactly do I like about Gronk? When it comes to YouTubers, I'm really looking for someone that has a soothing voice. And Gronk is definitely one of those people, because his voice is, it's kind of deep. It's basically like a blanket that's covering you and that keeps you warm. That makes you feel good, you know. Keine? Thief Deadly Shadows, voll geil. Aus Thief Deadly Shadows könnte ich mir sogar vorstellen, aber wer inzwischen ja tatsächlich was für ein Retro Channel. He is pretty much true to himself and that is a really really important strength as a YouTuber. I mean, sure, at the end of the day he is an entertainer. He is basically entertaining people, but that doesn't necessarily mean that he has to do what the viewers want him to do and he is pretty aware of that, which I think is pretty professional. A little highlight for me personally is his annual recap, which can be quite long. But regardless of that, it's just a pleasure to listen to what he has to say about things that went on regarding both his channel, his own activities, and well, other things that are happening. Das ist auch eine Sache, die beschäftigt einen natürlich. Jetzt, äh, wo man seit mehreren Jahren hauptberuflich äh, hier so rumfrühend, ähm, da macht man sich natürlich auch Gedanken. Und ich muss ehrlich sagen, YouTube wird den Weg Gehen, den alle Medien in Deutschland gehen. And by the way, I didn't get paid for saying any of this. It's just that I really think he's creating well entertaining and pretty cool content. I've never met him before, but maybe I might have the chance to say hi at this year's Gamescom. Who knows? So und Vlog Dave. Auch dir vielen Dank. So if you want to test your comprehension skills regarding spoken German on YouTube, well, give Gronk a try. Why not? Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and to share it with other people. And if you want to support this channel even more, check out my Patreon page. A little tip per video can make a difference and help me a lot. Also feel free to follow me on social media. I'm your Vlog Dave. Tschüss und bis zum nächsten Mal.